Hello you guys and welcome back to the vlog. If you're new here, my name's Mary Margaret and today we're just kind of having a chill vlog. I know I'm definitely filming today and possibly a little bit tomorrow. So I'm just gonna take you guys along for whatever we get up to. I finally got my hands on the Jerf Avenue pajamas. I am obsessed. I will say, I'm pretty sure I did a medium in the top because I wanted it to be like oversized. And then I did size small in the shorts and I probably could have done an extra small or extra extra small. So I feel like that's something to note if you're also looking to get them. They're obviously still like super comfy and like I can get away with it, but if I were to order another set, I would probably size down, but I'm just obsessed. It's my first time wearing them and it's so soft. I wish you guys could feel this material. I know I'm gonna be wearing them all the time. I am just getting ready for the day. I just switched into this outfit and literally everything is from Amazon. Everything is so good. I just posted a like massive Amazon summer try on video. So I'll link it up in one of these corners if you guys wanna go and watch. But I did show both of these pieces and they're just so good. This is just like a little Heather Gray basic tank top. And then these linen pants are my absolute favorite right now. I can't stop wearing them. They have a stretchy waistband, they have pockets, and I feel like the fit is just perfect. These shoes are also from Amazon. There's a little bit of a platform, but they're so comfortable to walk in. Super chill look to go get my nails done. We're about to head out to California, so I wanna switch it up. These are a little outgrown. This is what I'm thinking of doing. It's like yellow chrome. I've been considering it for the past few times now, so I think we're finally gonna do it. That's kind of the plan for today. It's currently 8.40, my appointment's at nine, so I do need to run out the door and head that way. But we're gonna have a fun little day. It's sunny outside, who knows, maybe we'll get some sun, go lay by the pool. Um, and then later tonight, I'm going to a fun little like influencer dinner at this new restaurant in Seaside called Day Trader. So I'll take you guys along for that. It's very aesthetic and I'm excited to try it out. I am back for my nail appointment and I am obsessed. I feel like they came out so good. My nail girl is so nice. She always like does a test round on like an acrylic nail to make sure it's going to be exactly what I want. And so she ended up having to swap her original nail color to get it more how I wanted. But they are so cute. I literally love them. They're so fun and summery. And I feel like it'll be fun for LA and Malibu. I feel like it's just like a good fun summer color. I actually also ended up getting my toes done done me like trying to hold up my foot but <laughs> i just did um not i almost did bubble bath but i actually did it's the other like really popular opi color um if i can think of it i'll put it on the screen right here but just a very simple light neutral color on my toes i did gel i just started doing that recently and i literally love it i don't know why it took me this long to try it but that is the nail update it is now about 11 a.m so i think i'm gonna head up maybe eat a snack and I think I'm gonna throw on a swimsuit and go lay down by the pool for a little bit. My chest and legs got fried yesterday. I went to the beach with Grace, but I think because I'm gonna be posting, I'll just tan my back so I can like hopefully even out. So that is the little plan for now. I am back from the pool. I actually also went to the gym, but totally forgot to film it. So I just got out the shower. I just rinsed off and washed my hair real quick before our dinner later this afternoon. I wish I would have filmed my workout, but it was honestly just kind of like a bunch of random stuff today because I went yesterday and so today I'm super sore. So I couldn't do like as much as I wanted. I did a little bit of abs, a little bit of arms, and then I also did some sprints on the treadmill. And I honestly switch up what I do every single time that I go. I have like a few few set things that I know I like to do, but honestly, I like just looking up TikToks or like if I'm scrolling and I see something on my For You page, I'll save it and then just like go back and look at it when I'm at the gym. So maybe I'll film like a little workout healthy reset video. That might be my next one. So 
keep your eyes out for that if that's something you're interested in. But while I was down at the pool, I got some packages. So I wanted to show you guys real quick. First up is from Gizu. I actually just talked about Gizu in my Q&A because someone was asking about my hair care routine. I use their honey infused hair oil all the time. The packaging is so cute and it smells so good. They also have a hair perfume, which is so fun. They also sent their polishing primer. I haven't used this product yet so I'm excited to try that one out and then they also sent their beauty balm which I haven't used this either so I'm so excited to try out some new products and then I also got two new swimsuits from triangle I love triangle I've been buying their swimsuits since I was in high school I used to save up all of my money and I've got like the classic royal blue neoprene bottom and like the fishnet triangle shaped top. I'll have a picture of it right here on the screen, but I feel like the OG triangle girls know what I am talking about. So I have always been a big fan of triangle. I love their stuff and I love that their suits come in these cute little pouches because I always use these when I'm traveling to put like my socks and underwear and bras in or like my swimsuits or sometimes I even bring this to the beach and throw like my sunscreen and stuff inside because it's just a neoprene bag. So if stuff spills in it, it's not the end of the world. This is my favorite style from them. It's just like their bralette shape. I just think it's the most flattering on me and like I feel the most comfortable in it. It has adjustable straps, which I love, but look how cute this pattern is. I'm obsessed and it's like their classic like silky material. And then here are the matching bottoms. I love that you can do like cheeky or their regular cut and then you can also do different sizes for top and bottom. And then this one, oh my gosh, I'm excited to wear this color. Look at how like bright neon orange this is. It's also a velvet material, which is so fun. And it's the same exact style as the first one. And again, with the matching bottoms, I actually sized up this time. I usually do smalls, but I wanted to like be able to hike the bottoms up on my hips so i did mediums this time i haven't tried them on yet but i feel like they'll fit fine and then i also got this little like button up but super lightweight and i feel like i can just throw this on over my swimsuit when i'm heading to the beach and then the other package that i got is actually already in the wash because it's what i wore to the gym but i got a workout set from j80 fit i've never tried any of their products before but i was actually so impressed this is what it looks like it's like a sage green color it was almost heathered which was really different i've only seen heathered gray i haven't seen like a heathered color so that was really cute the top has like a little twisty and i swear this material was the softest thing it felt like butter um and i did size small for top and bottom but i love that workout set clearly because i've already started wearing it but yeah that concludes our mini haul other than that i've just been like doing a bunch of laundry because tomorrow is going to be a packing day and i've started getting out like a little pile of clothes of all of the things that I'm thinking I want to bring with me to Malibu. I need to try everything on and just like make sure it makes sense because right now I've just kind of like picked a few things from my closet but I'm excited to get going on that. I usually always wait like the last second to pack. I have a big pile that has been accumulating of stuff that I want to bring to Goodwill so I might take you guys with me to go drop that off. I need to get gas and I kind of want to get a car wash too. So we'll see what else we get up to before dinner later. It has been like an hour since we got back from car wash and dropping off our donations. And I think I'm gonna start getting ready for dinner because me and Grace need to leave here in like 30, 40 minutes. So I am in a little bit of a time crunch, but I'm not gonna do too much makeup. I feel like in the summer, especially when I have a tan, I really don't like to put that much on my face. I also have a mirror right here, so if I'm like looking up this way, that is why. I feel like my skin's been pretty good lately. I feel like in the summer is when my skin is the best just because between being in the salt water and the ocean and getting lots of sun, my skin thrives in the summer. In my Q&A video, I talked about how I have been on 
birth control for seven years now, which is literally insane. But I know part of being on birth control is it like balances your hormones, which affects your skin. I usually just have like a few breakouts around the time of my period. Um, but I am very curious like when I come off of the pill, whenever that time comes, how my skin is going to react because it has relied on the pill for literally years. <laughs> So I'm a little nervous that I'm gonna have a bad reaction, but when that time comes, I'll definitely like keep you guys up to date and I might film like a little series or something on TikTok. Where we're going, it's called The Day Trader and it is a new restaurant in Seaside. I always get lots of questions on like recommendations of places to go, things to see and like, uh, good food spots in 30a. I actually have a highlight on my Instagram and I've updated it a few different times So if you're coming to the area and you need recommendations definitely go and check that out But tonight we're going to a new restaurant I've never been before and it just opened up recently. It's very aesthetic and like girly I'm pretty sure there's lots of like fun wallpaper Pops of pink and I think it's like a tiki bar styled restaurant So I'm very curious to see what the menu is going to be. I've only heard good things about it, so I'm sure it's gonna be amazing and I'll obviously take you guys along show you all what it looks like what we end up getting and all of that All right makeup is done. I am so sad because my lip liner is out and I don't know where like the pencil sharpener went So I haven't been able to use my lip liner in so long and that was my favorite part of my makeup routine Because I felt like it just like brought everything together So I don't have anything on my lips right now, but I've been loving the YSL candy glaze I have it in like five different shades. So I keep one in like each of my purses I have this one in my makeup bag from the bottle. It looks like a lipstick on your lips, it looks like lip gloss, but it feels just like chapstick. I literally can't stop using this and it smells and like tastes good. So that's a plus, but this is the finished makeup look. Very bronzy and glowy and now I need to go pick out an outfit. All right, this is the dress for tonight. I am obsessed with this color and just wearing pink in general, but this is from Grey Bandit last summer. I'm pretty sure they still have it and even in other colors. So definitely go check it out. I actually have a code with them. It is Mary Margaret, so I'll have it on the screen right there. So I'm just wearing these little sandals from Revolve. These are my favorite for the summer, but this is the fit. I'm gonna wait for Grace to get here and then we'll be on our way. Hello you guys, I have not picked up my camera once today just because we've been so go 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 But I'm currently packing and like trying outfits on for Malibu And I thought I would pick up my camera and show you guys what I'm working with This is just one of the outfits that I am trying on to see what I want to pack I have it paired with these really cute like cushiony shoes from Amazon. I think I showed you guys these yesterday, but this is one fit. I'm literally obsessed. And then I have a little pile going right here with all the other outfits that I've tried on. So I will put a few of the pictures on the screen right here so you guys can see what I'm packing. But I feel like for LA and like when I think of California, I don't know why I'm always drawn to neutrals and like an elevated like I don't know, the style is different there than it is from here in like tropical Florida. So um, my outfits are gonna be like a little bit more different than what I would typically wear here, which I think is fun. I love like switching it up and getting to dress for the area that I'm going to. So this is like a little sneak peek of some of the outfits that I'm thinking about wearing. And I think I'm gonna do a checked bag for this trip just because we have so much stuff that we want to bring. Even though we're only going for I think four full days, honestly, it's kind of like five full days because the day that we fly out our flight isn't until 6 30 p.m so we'll technically still have like a whole day but i just wanted to check in give you guys a little update on where i'm at but yeah we're starting the packing process i'm also trying to decide like what accessories i want to bring so i have all these really cute sunglasses laid out and then i need to pack jewelry and all that stuff i'm using my packing cubes these are literally a lifesaver if you don't have some you need to get them they make the biggest difference um, if I can't find these exact ones, I'll link similar 
pair below, but I just got these off Amazon. Let's start off with the biggest one. This is what it looks like right now. I have loungewear and pajamas in this big pouch. And I think I'm going to put all of like my underwear, bra, socks, all of that in this one as well. Wow, that legit fits perfectly. And then I have this entire whole other side to put like shoes, toiletries, makeup, all that stuff. So I'm feeling pretty good about packing. Kind of turned into like a pack and prep, even though that wasn't what it was intended to be. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already so you don't miss out on the Malibu video, but I will see you guys in the next one.